Hello there, this is Vanessa Duberlay, and today we're going to learn how to do a wavy text that you can add to your video or any other social media that you have, especially when you're, um, you can use it for your Instagram posts, Facebook posts, all kinds of things. Canva is actually amazing. If you haven't been using it, dig in. There are lots of things that it does, but today we're going to make a wavy post. I'm going to show you an example here. I just made this uh, within less than five minutes easily, but I'm going to show you how I did this. Many of you are aware of the curve that you can do using Canva, but I'm going to show you how to make a wavy text. Let's go ahead and add a page and I'll show you how I did this. I went in and just looked for person. I was looking for something positive, but I'll go ahead and this is what came up when I typed in person. You can put any background that you want. You can use just a plain color or um, a picture. So let's go ahead and use that pineapple again. It's a little positive and we'll, I'll show you exactly what I did. I went into text. I used the heading. You can always change that and I typed in you've got this I was just looking for something positive now if you just type in the whole sentence this is what many of you are aware of that you can do I'm going to change my um, text real quick there we go Here we go, something a little bigger. And now we're gonna go into text and we're gonna go into effects. And many of you are aware of all the different effects that you can put in. And if you go down here to the bottom, you can curve it. Now the problem is I want more of a wave. I don't wanna just curve it up or down. And how, how do we get that to happen? Because the whole thing keeps moving, right? Back and forth. So let's go ahead and separate this in the middle. So I'm gonna get rid of my wave. We'll just put none. And I'm going to copy the whole thing. Let's get the text. There we go. Copy text. And we'll paste it down here. And one of them will have the first two words and the second one will have the end. So we're going to delete the top here. And then on the bottom, we'll delete the front. There we go. So now I've got two different texts and we're going to curve it. So let's go to the first part. We'll go under effects, slide down here to where it says curve, and I'm going to curve it down. That's a little bit too much. So we're just going to back it off. Usually about 51 seems to be nice somewhere in the fifties. So let's do 51. And over here, I want it to curve the opposite way. So we're going to do a negative 51. So we want to go over here, type in 51. What, whatever you decide, you just want them both to be the same. And you've got your curved text. And there you go. Let's go back and do a different one and start from scratch. So here I just typed in person. This is the two that came up. So let's just do the other one. It, it, this is under backgrounds. You can go under elements. You can go under um, photos. I'm um, in um, backgrounds is what I have here. All right, let's just go ahead and put some text in there. We'll make the text larger. I'm going to go ahead and make it bold so it stands out a little better. And I'm going to copy it. Right click, copy, and control V. And we want to split it right in the middle. Now I'm going to try something different on this one. I'm going to split it right in the middle of the word nobody, because that is in the middle. And on this side, we'll take away the front. Let's see how it comes out. This is what's fun about Canva, is you can just play with it. And see, now we're going to connect it like that. Let's go down and do our effects down to our curve. Let's just use 51. That seems to work, doesn't it? 
I don't know that we might want less of a curve let's do 48 and see how that comes out yeah it's a little bit less and do this one 48 effects negative 48 you can just type it in and we have a curve and we're going to connect that look at that pretty cool there you go so have fun create <laughs> start putting some of that curve in some of your text all right thanks for watching and you have a good one and i put videos out every tuesday to help you turn your passion into profit and that means building your youtube channel and getting your passion out there so other so that you can share it with other people and then making a profit from it